Hey YouTube, this is Southern Purple One, and the world is definitely crazy. Every day you can tune into the news, uh, you can tune into YouTube, and, and you can see we're on a course um, that is very perplexing. Um, we're definitely moving down a pathway that you need to be prepared. If you're watching this channel, you probably are somewhat prepared. Some of you are probably really maxed out, ready for uh, terrible events, and some of you are just starting down uh, the road of prepping. It can be overwhelming, especially when I start talking about logistics and having multiple year supply of you know nuts and bolts and this and that. Um, it can be confusing. I don't want you to freeze up and just say, oh, I give up. You need to start with little tiny steps. The first step you need to start with is water. Water is the key to everything. Without clean water, you're not going to be functioning that well. Uh, you're going to get sick, and then you will have no ability to even weather the storm because you'll probably be in the bed uh, with some type of waterborne disease. As you know, I sell a water filter. Uh, JD is my partner, and we have been selling these for a few years, and they are selling great. Uh, the reason they're selling great is because my picture's on the front. No, they're selling great is because my picture's on the front. I want to make sure this is the best product and the most affordable product. Uh, my goal here is to educate, uh, and the side part of that is I can make some money. Um, so we have placed these on Amazon at the lowest point we can do and still make some money and provide a great filter. Uh, I think this filter is one of the best on the market for this type, an emergency straw filter. Uh, this is a water straw. This is good for 1,100 gallons of water. Uh, basically, it's very easy to use. You pop the end off, pop the other end off, put that in the dirty water, and suck just like a normal straw. The water will go through the membrane, and you will end up with water that will not kill you. It will be 99.9%. Uh, you can check it out and check out everything that it protects you from, but this is an emergency water filter um, that you definitely can use. Uh, especially if you have a rain catchment system. You can also attach it to a bottle, so say this is dirty water, and you can take it with you, and then you can drink out of it, or you can simply turn it over and let gravity work, or you can actually squeeze it, and you're squeezing the water through. So you can squeeze it into a cup. Um, we have these in five packs and two packs. The five pack is only $39.99. Uh, it's $8 per straw. We can't take it any cheaper. Um, but this is something that most of you probably already have. And if you have another brand, good. Don't go on buy my straws if you, you're covered in the water section. Uh, I do say, though, if you can afford it, put some of these back for your neighbors. Uh, $8. It will come five to a pack, or they have a two pack. We have a two pack. And it will be individually wrapped. So you can actually give these away at Christmas time or anything. Um, you don't have to give someone the whole box of five. Um, but this will definitely save someone's life. This is, will let you uh, give something to your neighbor. Um, and yes, you want him to live, but also if he understands that you just provided him with drinking water, he's going to be an asset to you. Maybe uh, he'll be open to working together. And in a grid down situation, numbers matter. The amount of people on your side, because that brings with you more people is a plus. It also brings you more resources. It also brings you more skill sets. Yes, more people means you got to provide more food for them, or the area has to provide more food, uh, the environment. But it's always good to have more people and more skill sets. So this is a shameful plug for my water filters. I believe it is the best one on the market, and I know we're the cheapest on the market. We're the cheapest on the market is we'd rather sell a thousand straws and make the same amount of money than selling a hundred straws. Um, so, if you have water checked off your box and you feel you're good, today I'm challenging you, if you got a bunch of containers full, check your water container. Typically, if you're using city water that has chlorine in it, it's not going to go bad over time, but you do have a quality issue. Water can become stale where it's not as good. Uh, so, if you need to, Refresh your water. Take this water outside and water something um, and then refill it. If you're using well water, uh, you have more of a chance uh, that you might need to refresh your water sooner than city water that is slam packed with chlorine. 
Uh, the chlorine definitely keeps the water safer. But either one, evaluate your water supply today. Um, if you got any questions about water, put them in the comment section. Water is your number one. Other than air, which we all know we need that too, but water is the next on the list. you got to have water. So I'll put a link to it. I appreciate any support. A lot of people ask me, hey, Dave, how can we support your channel? Can we donate? Do you have a donate button? I don't have a donate button. I don't want you to donate to my channel. Uh, if you want to support me, you can buy some straws uh, for your personal use, or if you know you have family members or, or neighbors that are not prepping, uh, a purchase like this would definitely help. Thanks for watching.